Hey man, where's that thing that you're putting your hammer on your Diamondback? That's kind of cool. That's right, the hammer holster is one of the key pieces to the Diamondback setup. I'm going to walk you through here how the hammer holster and the flat bar holster work to keep your tool belts uh, more organized, keep you safer on the job, keep you more comfortable on the job, and keep you from dinging and banging into things around the job. So, the hammer holster will fit on any pouch. Uh, we make it in a right side version and a left side version, so make sure you order the right one. Uh, this is I'm a righty, so this is my dominant side. I've got my hammer holster here. You see my hammer is right where it should be. I'm not having to bend around backwards and do some kind of gymnastics to put my hammer in here. It's padded, so it's not beating me in the leg. It's not hitting me in the knee. I don't even know it's there until I need it, okay? Uh, with this retention strap on the back, I can adjust the cant on this. That's important if you're up on a roof. Maybe sometimes you want to keep your hammer almost uh, parallel to the ground. If you're up on a roof and you're leaning over a little bit, you can adjust it down so that your hammer's not going to slide out when you're up on a roof. It attaches to any of our pouches. All of our pouches come with grommet holes up here at the top. I got two bolts with nylon uh, insert washers, uh, nuts on the back so they won't back out. Uh, when you order this, crank it down nice and tight and you won't have any problems with it falling off and your hammer's right where you want it. On the other side, we got a flat bar holster. Flat bar holster is down here underneath my Wrangle pouch on this Denali setup and it again fits on any of our pouches. It only has one uh, bolt rather than two, but it's also got an adjustment strap so you can adjust the angle that this is sitting in and I can put, I've got a pry bar, I've got a catch ball in here right now, I can put up to three uh, bars in here and keep them right here on my left side or non-dominant side so when i do make that inevitable mistake i've got my hammer and my bar right hand pop that nail out move on to the next one of course you framers you guys just leave them where they are leave it to the trim guy or the drywall guy to fix your mistakes but you know anyway if you actually cared about your mistakes you can fix them very easily um check out the hammer holster and the uh, flat bar holster Thank <laughs> you.